teacher talking sports, what it does, what it do, how we live. And it's always quite sad when one of a sport's greatest talents go down with a major injury. And that happened in baseball yesterday. Uh, we know Ronald Acuna left the game with a knee injury. His leg kind of just buckled as he um, attempted to go to third on a steal or a fake steal, not quite sure. Just fell down, and now we know the news. ESPN, Jeff Pass and Braves, Ronald Acuna Jr. out for season with torn left ACL. This is the reigning NL MVP. Won it unanimously. Now, he's not off to a great start this year. 250 batting average, just four homers, uh, still 16 stolen bases, and obviously still plenty of baseball to go for him to turn it around, 112 games left. Uh, but this is the second time that he's torn his ACL. This time it was his left in 2021. It was his right. Mentioned they've already lost a Spencer Strider for the season. Uh, but keep in mind, they can't stay too disappointed, too upset. They have to remember they actually won the World Series the year they lost Acuna. Uh, they lost him a little bit later in the season that year with his torn right ACL. That was in uh, July. Of course, this is late May. Uh, so, you know, it's a, definitely a tough loss. If we take a look at fan graphs, uh, they expect Adam Duvall to take his spot in right field. Now, Duvall, uh, when he's played, has mostly been playing in left field, taking the place of Jared, Jared Kalenic. Uh, but now will likely become the full-time right fielder. Uh, he's batting 207 on the year with four homers and 82 at-bats. Uh, they're going to keep Ozuna at DH in all likelihood. I mean, he's been incredible. Uh, but you also have to remember that 2021 team, especially when... Um, Acuna went down, Ronald, uh, Marcelo Zuna was on administrative leave, uh, mentions they acquired Jock Peterson from the Cubs on July 15th, uh, they were orbiting around 500, that was when Acuna got hurt, as the deadline neared on July 30th, Atlanta dealt for Jorge Soler from Kansas City, Eddie Rosario from Cleveland, and Adam Duvall from Miami, well, Rosario ended up winning NLCS MVP as he hit three homers in the NLCS. And then Jorge Soler won World Series MVP as he hit three homers in the World Series. So Alex Anthopoulos uh, will be looking to work his magic again. Uh, really did a great job retooling the team in 2021 after Acuna went down with that major knee injury. Another knee injury, and he's got a little more time to try to um, help the roster out in the absence of Acuna. But tough loss. Also, remember when he suffered that injury, uh, he came back the next season and didn't quite look like same the same player. Uh, struggled in 2022, at least by his standards, he struggled. Um, came back right for the start of the season, so... Uh, it was a quick recovery, but we will see if this will affect him. I mean, he's still just 26 years old, but obviously there will be a new NL MVP winner um, as compared to last year. Uh, Mookie Betts, in my eyes, is the favorite as of now, but <sighs> let me know in the comments maybe some guys you expect the Braves to maybe go after, or do you think Adam Duvall can hold for it? Uh, with Acuna out for the season, and the Braves can, you know, still remain a World Series threat without really having to make moves. But tough loss for Acuna and the Braves. Anyhow, don't forget to subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe. Like the video, share the video, hit the bell for notifications. I'm out.